Hi, I'm Todd Cooperider with Esoteric. Welcome to our FAQ series. Today's question, how do I know what pad and polish to use when I'm polishing my car or getting ready to polish a car? It's a very common question, particularly people are relatively new at it uh, ask. I don't know how many times over the years people have asked that, hey, I got this car coming in how do I know what to, to use? Or I got light swirls, what should I use uh, with it? Well, what you really wanna do is you want to establish a system of products and pads that you're gonna use on a regular basis that gives you the most consistency from you know one car to the next, be it light color, dark color, clear coat, single stage, what have you. And it really comes down to, once, you've, once you have your products to use, it comes down to doing that test section. There's no you know, magical combination of, of what you should use to get the most out of it. That test section that you do to start off with is gonna tell you everything that you need to know. What is the test section? You know, Basically, you're taking a little area, say, of the hood, you're going and doing your polishing stage uh, on it, whatever you know, you're wanting to do, whether it's multi-stage or single stage, and you inspect it afterwards and see what kind of results that you're getting out of it. If it looks good, you run with that process. If not, you change something up. Maybe you do another test section next to it that's more pressure. Did it get better? Then you know you're going in the right direction. Did it get worse? If so, do another test section with a little bit less pressure to see how that uh, change. One of the big mistakes a lot of people make is they have too many products to choose from. I remember back in the day, my early days of polishing, you know, I had eight or nine different compounds and polishes, all these different pads, it's just way too many variables, way too many combinations, and you can waste a tremendous amount of time. Like if you're a DIY person at home, you're wanting to work on uh, your own car, you're probably not starting off buying a lot of different products, but like if you look at our Rupus One Step uh, uh, kits, for instance, we have teamed it up with what we have found to be the most consistent combinations of products that you're gonna get. You're gonna get the yellow Rupus uh, polishing pads and you're gonna get the Sonax Perfect Finish. Here in the shop, we could do probably 98% of everything that we need with one polish, one compound, one polishing pad, and one compounding pad. So we reduce our variables, it makes the process much, much easier. So going back to the beginning again, it is that test section that's gonna determine what it is, but you also wanna make sure that you don't have too many products, too many variables in there because you can waste a lot of time. You wanna learn a little bit more about the test section, click on this next video because we go into a little bit more details of it.